we're going to analyze uh, sodium triazo carbonates sodium triazo carbonates or sodium carbonates and the um, report is what we have here and in this report um, we have a, so the sample of salts to be seen that is sodium triazo carbonates is represented by the letter C so in this one in the first phase there what we have they put the sample of C into a test tube and add distilled water when you add distilled water what you will notice is that the solution to be soluble soluble and is colorless solution and gives was colorless solution this colorless solution indicates that um, colored ions are absent ions are absent and then ions like sodium ion potassium ion ammonium ammonium um, ion likely likely present so to the solution above to the solution above test with litmus paper then add barium uh, chloride solution barium chloride solution now on testing with litmus paper um, red litmus turns blue turns blue and on adding a uh, barium chloride the, we have white white precipitates formed white precipitate formed um, what it means here is that the solution is what alkaline or basic and the white precipitates form means that um, the trisurfaces ion is likely present the trisurfaces ion is also likely present and carbon trisocarbonates ion likely also likely present so so this the next one to the mixture above add dilute hydrochloric acid then bubble into bubble bubble into lime water when we add dilute hydrochloric acid we notice an evolution of odorless odorless colorless gas gas which which turns lime water Milky that confirm the uh, carbon carbon four gas. Confirmed. Carbon four gas confirms. So to another question, okay, we can let's continue with our analysis. But now we're going to look at how we're going to get this ion. The sodium ion, which is in a triazo carbonate, sodium triazo carbonate, like I told you earlier on, the gas, the sample we are analyzing is sodium triazo carbonate. So, to the uh, another sample of that uh, 
sodium trisocarbonate, we dip the plume wire or glass rod into hydrochloric acid. Then we put that in into the sample. Then and then we heat, heat it in a flame or heat in what is observed is um, golden yellow colored flame which confirms sodium ion confirmed all right thank you so much um for being part of this class and we want you to, we would like you to share and we're looking forward to you know respond to your comments in the comment section and if you have not subscribed make sure you subscribe thank you so much